Hi guys, welcome back to another edition of More Small Moment and this week we are going to be discussing shoes. Now, we've had a, um, a viewer write into us and ask us the question, can you please show me how I can match shoes to my suits because usually I go into the shop, I buy shoes, I like the way the shoes look but often when I match them to my outfit, he's unsatisfied. So today, we're going to talk through the best ways to match your shoes to your suit and, well, our personal opinions on how we tend to do it ourselves. Um, so Senna, what would, you, what would you say was the best or the first step in the process of doing this? Um, the first step is obviously, you know, seeing what suits, the majority of the suits that you have, so whether they're dark suits, light suits, yeah. and then match accordingly. I mean, if you haven't got any good suits in your wardrobe, I'd always suggest start off with black. Yeah. Because black is the most versatile. Mm -hmm. uh, color to go with and then you know there's a number of factors that come into it whether it's the style of the shoe based on the width and the length of your trousers but I don't want to get too technical on that because there's so many different opinions on that so let's stick with mainly color I yeah. guess I'll say color and style color and I style those yeah. are the two options I was yeah I think are quite important so color and style yeah but for me I'm like you I start with color then go style second mm -hmm. So yeah, um, again as I mentioned, so basically the darker the suit, stick with black. So if you've got um, obviously a black suit, always black. Um, a navy suit, black works, dark greys, even light greys. Pretty much anything works yeah. with black, works with black. Think, even brown. Yeah, browns. I think for dark suits for me, I like like mahogany browns, like really dark browns, or even mm -hmm. sometimes you see the burgundy colours. They tend to work well with um, dark suits if you don't want to wear black. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that was going to be my second option. Okay, yeah. sorry. If once you've gone through black, yeah. then you've got the dark browns to go for and things of that nature. And then for the lighter colours, whether they be light greys, uh, light blues and things of that nature. As in suits, you mean? Light as suits, yeah, yeah, as suits. Um, yeah. Then you go for the more uh, the brown, light browns, tans, things of that nature, because those will complement the suit more. Funny you thing is, the, the lighter colours, you, you can tend to wear any shoes. Yeah. But obviously, those yes. are the best ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just with the darker suits, you're, I think you're limited to mm -hmm. so what you're going to have. With the lighter suits, you can tend to wear any shade. However, yeah. The lighter shades tend to be better. It really irks me when I see guys, I know they're trying it, they're actually trying to do their best. Yeah. But when they wear a navy suit with a light tan shoe. Yeah, it just, yeah. It, it doesn't work. If you're gonna wear the light tan, wear it with a light blue, not not navy. Yeah, so, and a light grey. I think they, they, it tends to work really nice. Yeah, very, I mean, very nice. Again, it, it's, it's, it's all a matter of opinion. Mm -hmm. Some guy might look at the navy and love it with a tan, and okay, cool, that's your opinion. I wouldn't say it's completely wrong, it's just mm. not what we tend to like to go for. Yeah. But again, it's all opinion. Well, do you want to talk about the style of the shoe now? Or? So, yeah. the style of the shoe... But style of the shoe really depends on the type of suit that you're wearing. Exactly, so, so he wants to know how to match shoes to his okay. suits. Yeah. So, for example, if you're wearing, if you're going for a business attire, for example, wearing a pinstripe suit, yeah. I'd probably go for lace-ups um, rather than tassel loafers yeah um, and again it, it does depend because you can get some tassel loafers which do work with um, pinstripes but again it does casual down the suit so it, it depends where you're going to how you're wearing it yeah uh, no slipper shoes for sure uh -huh. um, double monks work very well yeah um, double monks and single monks. Yeah, monk straps. double, just monk straps. Yeah. yeah, if you're going for more casual outfit, you're going to an event or you know you're not in an office but you're wearing a suit. Yeah, uh, then you know tussle loafers all day long, uh, whether it be leather or suede or something of that nature. I don't know what else there is. Well, just normal loafers that have, to have tassels on them. No, they don't. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, <laughs> when I equate ta loafers, I think tassels because they just add that value, but they don't have to. Yeah, yeah. normal loafers, and I think again depending on your environment, right? So for example, if you're somewhere in, if you're in England, say let's say for example, our, our environment in London, right? Where it tends to be gloomy from time to time, a bit of sun, mm. I would wear my loafers with socks. Now if I was in the south of France or I was in um, Italy, Florence, Pitti Uomo, I'll probably wear my loafers without socks. It's just, it, all that just depends on the environment for me personally. Yeah. What do you reckon? Yeah, I agree, I agree. Um, yeah, your loafers, I mean, some people may say, oh, you're wearing loafers with socks. I actually heard somebody say it recently, but... Come on. It's, of course you can wear it with socks. You can. You, 
So you're, especially in Britain, that means your loafers are extinct for like 95% of the year. <laughs> you can wear, you can wear, you can wear loafers and socks, that's mm -hmm. ridiculous. I think that the ankle, the, the, um, the bare ankle look is a very nice look in summer. Mm. Um, and sometimes when you have a nice summer weather um, in, in London, you can get away with it when you're not going into the office. But I dare anyone to walk into, into the city of London and yeah. say bank, in a banking environment and go sockless. And just, come on, this is ridiculous, it just wouldn't happen. Mm -hmm. um, so loafers can be worn socks. And when I say sockless, I mean, I don't mean you don't wear any socks. There's some loafer socks that you can wear. It's invisible like, socks. Invisible socks, so they wrap around your foot. Go into the shoe and it looks like you're not wearing any socks, but you actually are. So yeah, no stinky not, feet, people. No stinky feet. <laughs> look after your shoes. <laughs> look after your shoes. After that, you then got all the other shoe categories you tend to find in like um, the high street shops, which tend to be more um, just dress up shoes. So whether they're like some blue sh lace up shoes or whether they're Painting, some woven, like yeah, and paint. Mm -hmm. It that all depends on now your personal taste. So for example, you might want to wear them with jeans, you might want to wear them with a suit or trousers or casually. That, that is a massive, massive question to answer to be honest, because there's so many options. But I feel like if you're try if you're struggling completely with what shoes to wear, the categories we've given you in terms of corporate and casual and then warm weather and, and, and cold weather, cold weather climate, should I say, that should serve you well as a starting point. Mm. So yeah. Cool. Yeah. So black suits, no brown. They can have so black suits only black, mm -hmm. grey, blue, brown suits. They can wear black. They can have brown. They can have depending burgundy, on the shade of and brown depending on the shade on the suit. Yeah, yeah. But, but you can wear that out by putting it together with just knowing like yeah. how dark it is. The darker the suit, the darker you want to go for the shoes. Yeah, so that's the most simple way to, to yeah. understand it. That is it, and you can't get any dark. Where if you got a black suit, you can't get any darker than black shoes, right? So. Yeah. Easy. Easy, but yeah, Easy. Um, so yeah, so shoes, shoes wise, that's how we match it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you never catch me in brown shoes in a black suit, but um, oh, not anymore, anyway. <laughs> but anyway, guys, look, thanks for watching. We hope you learned something. Can, how are you gonna round up my video? Oh, sorry, didn't you oh, open? No, did you? I know oh, you opened. I'm sorry, <laughs> anyway, guys, ahead. listen, look. He's, he called it his video. This is it's our video. Yeah. It's ours, it's yours. Video. It's, it's the whole it's community's mine. video. Like we're in it, but everyone, this is everyone's video. But either way, look, thanks for watching. Yeah. We hope you learned something. Take away the good parts. Throw away the rest. And we hope you like, subscribe, and comment on this video because we like to appreciate and I feel like we're all interacting. Look, we haven't had a chance to respond to um, the comments in so long, but you know what? Mm. We'll get on it. We'll we see them. It. We see them. We love them, and we take note of the questions that are coming in. So, what we're going to respond to those, and um, continue to follow us on our several social media streams from Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, and of course, sorry, someone in my eye, and of course, <laughs> and of course, YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. So um, that's it. See cool. you soon. See you soon, guys. Hold everything in my hand because I'm like. <laughs> I can't hold this bag today. Um, yeah. Anyway, that's... And this week, we're going to be do... <laughs> I get it completely wrong. So, this video is for shoes. Did you say completely wrong? Are you, making, are you making them seem no that way. bad? <laughs> <laughs>